So you've gotten your media on there, uh, you've dragged it, um, let's say you want to add a few more effects. So let's say, let's just for fun say you wanted to make this black and white. So I'm going to double click on the clip on my timeline, go up to effects control. Um, let's say I still have my fast color corrector effect in here. So I'm going to hit that arrow, scroll down. A um, couple ways to change the saturation. I could just click and drag the numbers to the left, hit the triangle, then I have a a bar I can click and drag. If I click and drag this all the way to the left, take out all saturation, it makes it black and white. So now I have two clips that uh, are black and white. So what I could do is I could do the exact same thing for the other clip if I wanted to. Just double click on it and now as you can see it doesn't have the fast color corrector. I'll have to come back down here, go to effects, um, it still remembers my last search so at this point I can just simply click and drag this up here I can click and drag it onto the clip itself but let's say you had tons of these clips you want to want to do that for every single one so what you could do is if I were to right click on the clip that I've already uh, created the effect for I can just right click click on copy and then right click on the clips I'm wanting to add to and again you can select mul multiple clips at once so if you had 20 other clips that you needed to add this effect you can just right click on all of those or highlight them all right click on it and then go up to paste attributes and it's going to ask you what are you wanting to paste well the only thing we're really wanting is the fast color corrector so you can just unclick everything else uh, besides that there's nothing else we're needing so I just have the fast color corrector uh, selected click OK and it applies that effect so now all my clips are black and white so that's pretty cool